I must be feeling pretty fancy today. I'm wearing my fancy hat. You know, fancy, super fancy, super fancy. I'm, I'm super, super fancy. <laughs> What is up, Rocks News Watchers? Uh, this is Rocks News, and today we have three new articles for you to see, and a lot of weird stuff going on in America right now. So, let's get to it. First of all, our first article. A man is offering to pay $10,000 to find him a girlfriend. So, apparently, a man in Alabama has actually been on approximately, like, 30 dates that were completely unsuccessful throughout 2014. And so, in order to remedy this little situation he's put himself in, he made a website that offers $10,000 for someone to find him a good girlfriend. I'm not sure if I should congratulate this guy, or if I should, like, just totally tell him that he's dumb. But, I mean, he's doing something, right? He's trying to... The idea of, hey, Find me a really good girlfriend and I give you a ton of money. But, like, first of all, $10,000 is a lot of money. Think about what you could actually buy for your girlfriend with $10,000, right? A lot. Yeah, yeah, a lot. Also, I don't know. This is interesting. I, I don't really know what to say about this guy. He's kind of... I, it's an interesting story, I guess, but, like, I mean, I don't know, do something inter more interesting with your life. All right, and in old man news, um, and this one's actually a little bit sad, um, a man named Sakari Momoi, uh, who was considered the oldest, the world's oldest man of the time period, dies at age 112 in Japan. He apparently stated specifically that the way, the reason why he lived so long was because he got a good night's sleep and he ate healthy throughout his life. Um, and so that was this kind of, like, long-living secret thing. He actually got, like, a Guinness World Record for being the world's oldest man. It's interesting, but, I mean, I don't know if you've ever seen the stories of, like, people in Africa or, like, India and stuff. They live to be, like, 130. I don't know. It's kind of weird. I mean, that's cool. He, he's old. Um, and it's awesome that he got an award for it, but yeah, I mean, it's, it's cool that he lived so long and that he had this wonderful long life and he, you know, he got all of the experience he could have had in 112 years. That's, that's about, gotta be pretty cool. Um, and I mean, yeah, it's sad that he died because I mean, he was the world's oldest man. So, I mean, I get where the, the, the news is coming from with that, I guess. Um, all right. In our next article, we have, um, fire news. Um, four young boys are charged with first-degree arson over a massive Oregon stadium fire. Now, in Oregon, there is a, um, I think it's a, a baseball stadium, um, or something, something along those lines, and it's, it's actually historic. It was on the National Register of Historic Places, um, for the United States, um, uh, and these kids literally burned it down. Disrespecting property in general like it's just it, I don't I don't think it's actually still in use but um, it definitely was a historic place and why would you burn it down in the first place I, I don't understand why um, the, in the pictures it's just like literally a big stadium burning one of the most almost creepily sad things about this entire story it specifically states that weeping onlooker it says Weeping onlookers mournfully sang, take me out to the ball game. I can only imagine what that actually sounded like. Like, take me out to the ball game. <laughs> that sounds so scary. It's like something out of a horror movie or something. Like, that. it's like all like crying and like, take me out to the Like, something like that. That could totally be, like, a, a scary movie. I don't know. That's, that's an interesting story. But, yeah, this is a really weird story just because I don't know what these kids were thinking burning down, like, this whole historic thing. And, I mean, it's 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 a cool, old, like, history thing. So, I don't know. They're messed up kids doing messed up things. They're breaking them laws. And, uh, you know, they're breaking the law. Breaking the law. That's pretty much what they're doing. 
But yeah, so that was Rock's News for today, guys. Um, I hope you enjoyed my little kind of going through stuff and everything. Um, as you may know, we got that new schedule going up on Facebook. I will play the video real quick to explain all of that. Hey, what's up, guys? So today we have some announcements for new timing and scheduling for the LG Rocks Productions channel. First of all, we have we will be moving my drawing videos over to Facebook exclusive only. So if you want to see my drawing videos, go check them out on Facebook because that's where they're going to be. At should be facebook.com slash LG Rocks Productions or just look at any of the descriptions in my YouTube channel. Instead of having exclusives on Fridays, we're going to put that and music and theater <laughs> on Wednesdays. So we're going to have music and theater and exclusives on Wednesdays. Yeah, so... and it won't be like a double thing. We'll be doing either a music and theater video or a exclusive video every Wednesday. So then we'll be having consistent videos on Wednesdays and Saturdays, which Saturdays will be her Carrie's Corner videos. Now, throughout the week, we'll just kind of have random videos for, uh, I'm gonna be doing a new gaming series just because, guess what guys, Arkham Knight is here. So we'll be doing some stuff for that and that's gonna be a lot of fun, I think. We might um, throw in some Minecraft because that's my favorite game ever. Exactly. And also, the Rocks News, guys, is has started, uh, I think, two weeks ago and it's been a little bit, because of our vacation and everything, it just hasn't really gotten very far yet, but that that should be like every day, every two days, something like that, because it's a quick little thing that I can edit and upload and throw up on there, and so that'll be a lot of fun, and that's pretty much where the channel's going, guys. That's pretty much how um, things will be running from now on. We'll have that, that Wednesday and Friday, and then everything else will just be random. Um, but yeah, I'll also be doing that Arkham Knight series. It's going to be awesome, guys. Got Rocks Gaming starting up with that Arkham series, and it's going to be a whole lot of fun, so I hope you guys check that out. And have a wonderful day, and we'll see you guys in the next video.